Hello guys, how are you? How are you? How are you? This is Albert. I'm here again to teach you on how to apply the green card by yourself, step by step. Sasa hivi na wapeleka on how you can apply the green card by yourself ukiwa uko married. Married with a kid. Married with two kids. Na wapeleka step by step when you apply green card mukiwa makapos na mukiwa married na muko na mtoto. Na wapeleka your steps Watch this video to the end and see itakusaidia namna gani. Na kama utakuwa na swali hapo kwa comment section. Remember to comment something at least to know ni wapi unapotelea ndio tukifanya the next video tujue tunafanya video ina gani. Hapa ni mali tutakuwa tunaongelea mambo na green card peke yake. Green card, green card na tunawaweishia all the best. It's the best thing to do to apply the green card by yourself apply peke yako ndi uweze kuwa na nyota kubwa ya kuwin green card wakati unachifanyia wakati unachichazia green card uko na nyota kubwa sana that's why nakwambia ufuatilie hizo ma steps ambazo nakufuata na kufunza ndi uweze kuchazia green card peke yako usiende the wrong website make sure you confirm the website venye nimekuambia hapa hivi nitakuelezea the website ndi ujue venye unafanya green card application zinaendelea I hope this time round I'm going to get more winners because to me badricha chinzi ya kufanya hizi maneno. Hizi maneno come May next year tutapata watu wengi ambao ni washindi na tutakuwa na furaha nyingine kubwa sana. All the best guys. Let me take you to the steps na ndapena example. The example the, the information I'm using is not the real information. It's all about random information but you being used like example on how you can apply ukiwa married let's go guys so guys ukikuja hapa hivi unakuja kwanza unaingia una, unafungua the website unaenda kwa chrome i love the website ni una type in the website ni dv program dot state dot gov that's the that's the website Wenye michitokeza hapo hivyo una click hiyo website inakuleta hizo maneno ni on the my previous video nilisha kufunza the 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 right photo example sasa sitakufunza sasa hivi utafuatilia from the last one sasa hapa tutaenda straight forward to begin entry kumbuka hii video nafanya ni ya makapos to begin entry ukiklik hapo hivyo itakuleta hii kitu Lazima uta enter hizo characters zenye siku hapa hivi kwa box in capitals r k e that's number 9 i think s a tatuone kama sitaingia yes zimekubali then tuseme first requirement lazima ukwe mwenye una apply kama couples kama we ni mwanaume lazima uko umemaliza form 4 ama uko umemaliza baka college ndi uweze kuwa the main applicant let's pick the main applicant hapa ni mwanaume hapa hivi tuweke last name ni Bosire Bosire ndio mwanaume sasa first name ni tuseme what's the first name tuseme tumweke jina kama maybe Peter Peter ni jina ya mwanaume alafu middle name tuseme just guessing work tuseme nani uh, ni Randy tuchukua hata hiyo uh, that's the last name kama uko na majina mbili peke yake you can indicate down here no middle name but kama uko na uko na jina you just put it down there uchukueke jina tatu ndio hiyo Ah, uh, tuseme huyu ni mwanaume lazima uweke hapa male, of course. Tukiteremka chini, teremke, tuweke miaka yake ya kuzaliwa. Tuseme amezaliwa mwezi wa sita Yo MM na maana mwezi na tarehe ni tarehe na tarehe 27 eh, mwaka ni 19 96. Mhm. Mm 1996. I'm just putting random age. Uh, but city to serve mezaliwa pale tika i'm just putting random then 
uh, country you were born, of course in Kenya. Kenya ndio hiyo. Alafu utakuja hapa hivi mbio, utakimbia hapa hivi. Country of eligibility iko yes, unasonga pichini. Kuja hadi hapa hivi, mali unachagua photo. Kuja hapa hivi, choose the photo from the gallery. Kaja nchukui picha nyiko sawa. Aha. Picture ndio hii moja yao. I think this picture is my Peter requirements. I choose it like that. Nikuja chini ni teremuke. Uh, in the care of, iko optional. Unaachana na ayo, unakuja line 2. Pio box 256. Una teremuka chini. Pio box 256, hapa line 2, optional, unahachana na ayo, unaenda city. City ni, tuseme ni kitui. Country or, or district or county ni kitui bado. Kitui. So. Alafu postal code tuseme ya kitui ni 9400 sijui siko shua. But hapa malipa postal code siyo shida kubwa. Uh, country ni Kenya of course. Uh, country you live today tuseme sayu naishi Kenya muko, uko katal. Kama uko Qatar eh, ni United Emirates ama tuangalie Qatar na kwa wapi Qatar Okay you kama uko Qatar sasa hivi country live today United Arab Emirates hiyo ndio Qatar Aha uh -huh. Uh, phone number, hapa iko optional, unaruka yu part, unakuja hapa chini. Email, weka tu email ya yota hapo hivyo, email yako, tumi email yako, itakusaidia kuenda kuko, wakati unanda kukonfirm. Ukitupa kon, your confirmation number, itakusaidia sana kumbuka yu email. Uh, level of education, kumbuka hapa ni high school, lazimu kume maliza high school degree. And then... High school degree, usichukue high school with no degree, chukua high school degree. Uh, kuna kamu kwa you know, un, some university courses, kamu kuna university na kwa graduate, unaza chukua, lakini kamu uja graduate, we kwa matuna hapa high school. Kamu uja graduate, kwa matuna high school. Because hiyo ndio requirement, wanataka, wanataka tu at least high school. Sababu hii tunafanya ni couples wa mbawa mewana. Kenyu utafanya hapa hivi, utandika married. Tachukua hii option 2, married and my spouse is not a US citizen. Tachukua hii option. Nateremuka chini. Uh, number of children, andika moja. Chatu andika tu moja. Alafu tutaeka continue. Ok. Continue, mesema spouse name. Hiyo sasa mefungua space ya wanamuke. Wanamuke tunasema last name ni... Maina, first name ni Diana, uh, middle name ni ngani? Tuseme hata hiyo, Mora. Yani tunachukua tu information tu. Uh, mwezi wa kuzaliwa ni mwezi wa toseme ni mwezi wa pili, uh, tarehe tisa, 
1990 we are just making love kumbuka huyu ni huyu ni mwanamke you have put female eh yeah? mwanamke ni female part city tusema amezaliwa pale kisi ama nyeri part city ni nyeri huko i love country of course in kenya alafu hapa hivi ah uh, ukuja hapa chini unachagua picha ya bibi yako una it's a permanent unverified eh you come here unachagua picha ya unverified wako hapa hivi picha ambayo iko sawa ndio huyu hii picha iko sawa you take it you choose this picture iko sawa hii picha imepita kila kitu alafu la. wamefungua spot ya mtoto number of children hapa wamesaba ni mtoto weka information ya mtoto hapa hivi tuseme mtoto anaitwa last name anaitwa kwamboka first name anaitwa clela alafu tuseme mtoto hana last name unaandika lazima kama hana last name kumbuka lazima uandike hapa no last name lazima uchukue hiyo check mark alafu na teremuka chini chukua date of birth ya mtoto ni amezaliwa tarehe moja mwezi januari uh, tarehe 20 tarehe 15 mwaka ni 2019 uh, 2019 Kumbuka mtoto hata akikuwa mdogo una, unaweza apply bado hata akikuwa amezaliwa 20 2023 Chani yake hiyo 2023 ndio mujue kama example 20 23 Mtoto amezaliwa hii mwezi mtoto ni wa months unaweka mwaka yake ndio huyo alafu kumbuka huyu mtoto ni msichana unaweka female then unaweka hapo chini Mali amezaliwa part city tuseme mtoto amezaliwa huko likoni hiyo ndio city alizaliwa huko alafu country the child was born in Kenya country ni Kenya alafu wapi unachoose the photo ya mtoto lazima pia uweke mtoto picha ya mtoto pia lazima iwekwe picha ya mtoto lazima uchukue uweke pia mtoto the same requirement the same photos that una, unapiga ya mtoto pia inafaa ina style upige picha mzuri iko na white background iko na kila kitu Intumie picha gani? Let me just use this picture. Just I'm using for an example because it's qualified. Uh -huh. Remember these are examples I'm using, eh? Tuseme hiyo ndio picha mtoto, naweka hiyo, alafu naweka continue. There you go. Kila kitu imeenda through, wamesema confirm the information, so you confirm the information, everything's fine. You go down, 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 down confirming the information in yuliaka kama kila kitu iko sawa you confirm you confirm you confirm naona kila kitu iko sawa information ya mtoto iko sawa information ya bibi iko sawa information ya bwana iko sawa ukifika hii part ya ku submit sasa hapa this is the final part kila kitu imekubalika unaweka maombi unasema all the father the son and the whole spirit nione huruma hii green card application najua watu ni wengi wana apply but i want you god this time round aki usiniache naenda ku submit consider my application ukifika hapo part lazima you have to put your god because hii application you are equal amongst everybody ni mungu tu acheze na kama yeye ndiweze kuangukia lottery una submit inakuwa successful
very successful kumbuka mwenye ameapply ni mwanaume ame include mtoto wake na bibi yake na kama wewe mwanamke pia mwenye umeinclude hapa hivi na we pia you are you are just uko na form 4 certificate unaweza fanya unaweza interchange unaweza kuwa pia we the main applicant u apply weke bwana yako na weke mtoto ndio mpate two slots of application the green card application is only once uweze apply mara mbili uki apply mara mbili una disqual for yourself but kama muna apply kama couples mnaweza interchange mmoja anaweza kuwa main applicant apply once na kama huyu mwingine pia kuna certificate anaweza apply kwa main applicant yeye pia kwe beneficiaries ndio mpate hizo slot mbili ya kufanya nini ya ku win green card you never know you never know guys vitu zinaweza badilika uweze kumshinde kama mme interchange hivyo lakini pia tuseme mpo, uh, you are verified person mmoja wenu hana certificate ya form 4 ule mwenye kuna some form for certificate ndiye anafaa kuwa the main applicant huyu mwingine akwe beneficiary akwe kama mtu wake wa mkono sasa yeye hata itajika certificate yoyote ukikuwa hivyo iko sawa pia inaweza kusaidia kama ukufika form 4 pia unaweza fanya hivyo mnaweza pata hiyo chance lakini sasa nyinyi hamta interchange sababu wewe una certificate ya form 4 kama una certificate ya form 4 wacha ule mwenye kuna certificate ya form 4 apply kama main applicant wewe kwe kama mtu wake wa mkono Na tawa wish you all the best kama hii video imekusaidia make sure you give it a like and then kama uko na swali unaweza drop comment hapa kwa comment section i love to weze jua tunafanya nini all the best all the best to all applicants tunawawishia mema kumbuka hii lottery ambao watu wanajaribu Kenya imewekwa kama Kenya imepewa nafasi ya ku apply uh, maybe next year unaweza pata Kenya wamesema Kenya haiko kwa draw ya kucheza green card because watu wana, wana, wameanza kuja America kutoka Kenya sasa you never know take this opportunity to apply before Kenya ifungiwe nje all the best to all applicants come may next year keep this confirmation number this confirmation number it's very important keep it hii ndio utatumika ku check results zako kama umewin siku ya kucheck itakuwa may next year ndio wakati watafungoje website tena ya kucheck result kama watu wameshinda Kama uta shinda bado kuna next time. Okay guys, this is very important. But hii confirmation tukuna ya hapa hivi, hii imetumika kama example. Hii hata ki win green card haita saidia. Hii ni kama, hii ni kama tu imetumika kama example tu ya kuchaza tu kuwafunza wewe. But the information to enter pala usitumia information weka your own information so that you can win the green card. Na wawishia mema na all the best. Thank you.